He really doesn't know how to deal with Blanca Ball. And he doesn't know any of Blanca's frame data. But he's going ham like he normally does. Doing cr oh, at least he didn't com commit to the combo. But he's working on, he's already doing the things that was showing him when we got here. But activates V-Trigger. And we got Blanca and V-Trigger shenanigans. All he needs to do is wait that out, but... But he has two stock. Meter. He can do something. So that's actually plus, but he actually anti-airs it trades, but it's in, in his favor. Like, a lot of people get scared of EX Rainbow Ball, but you can actually, you can actually anti-air it if you're on point. Ooh, excellent, meaty. Ooh, nice. Does he do a does he do an actual stun combo? Oh. All right. So he's got hit with the same setup twice. So I don't think Corey has any reason to to do that. And the down forward option is plus, so that was smart on him to EX up ball twice. But Corey takes the first game. Wonder if CJ will adapt. But he needs to just stay calm and block, take the throw. Right. Ooh, nice whiff Blanca ball. I think actually Nikali gets a heavy swipe punish after after Blanca Ball. Swiping in neutral. They're not he's not dealing with that. That's negative six. If he's doing regular. DJ's playing a little bit more patient. Didn't anti air the, the EX Rainbow Ball. Nice, he's at activating now. Nice dash up throw. EX, nope. No. <coughs> Whew. That was close. <laughs> I think all Corey really needs to do is harass with light light ball and he'll and he'll be all right. But he seems to be going in. That's working too. CJ is struggling to like get any footing. He had the answer for EX Rainbow Ball, but he just stopped. He just stopped doing it. Dash up again. Now he's just blocking him and then eating the throw. That's a lot of lack of knowledge on CJ's part. But, and uh, Corey takes that 2-0.